to the MCL7 launch event here at Blue Scope Western Sydney Service Centre at Erskine Park. Beautiful place that turned on the weather for us today as well. An exciting day to recognise and celebrate the $415 million MCL7 project which has now board approval. And I am led to believe 2007 was the year this service centre behind us was opened by the then Premier Morris Yemmer and it's so fitting that this was the first site in this industrial area. We're investing in our infrastructure, our products, our capabilities, but of course today is all about Western Sydney. As Tim mentioned, this site was developed or first started back in 2007 and back at that time we obviously had huge ambitions to grow the site. Uh, we've been very, very uh, fortunate I guess in the way that we've performed in recent years uh, and basically because of the growth that we've experienced in colour bond, uh, in particular in light gauge steel framing, true core, metal coated products more broadly, we're really out of capacity. And so what we're announcing today of course is metal coating line number seven. Just to put it in context, metal coating lines number one to five were all built between 1961 and 1979 and they are all still operating, they're all absolute work workhorses. Uh, metal coating line number six was built in 1992, so just over 30 years ago. And this facility is incredibly well regarded. The culture, the capability, the drive for performance. And there is no doubt in my mind that one of the factors that was in the board's mind that gave them the confidence to approve this project is because of the capability of this particular facility. It's, so, it's a fabulous culture, this, this part of our portfolio. We continue to grow colour bond, we continue to grow our residential steel framing. That's why we're making this investment. It's a vote of confidence both in our marketing and branding, uh, but more importantly our people, and it's a, it's a fantastic opportunity for us to continue to grow. Uh, we're on the path of transition here in Australia. We recognise the role that steel has to play in terms of decarbonising the process. It's not without its challenges, uh, but we're in a very good position to be able to take those challenges on. To you guys, most importantly, congratulations. This is a real vote of confidence in the Western Sydney Service Centre team, so very, very proud of all of you. Well done. And so, Mark, you said, rightly, this is a vote of confidence by the board in you and your team, but I think it's a vote of confidence in Australia as well. And on behalf of the Federal Government, as a member of the Cabinet and the local member, I welcome that very, very much. And I know from you know, somebody who grew up here, my dad worked in the industrial estate here, uh, how, what important part it is of our history and how proud I am that it's an important part of the future, and I know you are as well. But I'm very touched as I come home from Canberra last night uh, from Parliament to be back home, my own home patch, and to be supporting you and your work into the future. So congratulations, well done. Thank you very much. Well, I would like to invite everyone over to my left around those nice shiny shovels for the official sod turning. And then after that, please remember, stick around, have lunch with us, and uh, thank you very much for joining us this afternoon.